here we have the very long straight, straight where we can uh, touch the 260 km by hour. Hard brake in fourth gear for the corner number one, left, big left. Here it's very easy to go on the right, to go over the curbs. Then a lo long straight again, very brake for third gear for corner number two. Very slow airpin, big oversteering on the right. Then here we go for the third corner of the circuit. Also here is very difficult because we have a lot of oversteering on the power and then back to corner number four, right. Another very similar corner, corner number five, another right, very long here, easy to go under steering. Then a little straight, fifth gear, back to third gear, to the sixth corner. Then here we have the longest uh, straight after the main straight of the Valencia circuit where we can touch 230 km by hour. From sixth gear we go break down to third gear. Very long left corner, it's going downhill, very difficult also to see because of the sun. Then fourth gear in exit, fifth gear we make the chicane completely flat, we arrive fifth gear, break down to third. Very difficult to find a break point here for the core number 11. Third gear, fourth, then fifth. Now we are going to take the fastest and difficult, most difficult corner of the Valencia circuit, the core number 12, right and then left. Also on the, this left corner it's very difficult to stay completely flat because it's a very long left corner and very difficult to understand a breaking good point. Here we go for the last corner of Valencia circuit where it's very important to go early on the power not to have too much oversteering because it's very important to take all the speed to arrive as fast as possible at the start-finish line. 